I greet you in Jesus' precious name. And once again, welcome to the program. I want to speak to you today about a very important subject. And maybe because of the way in which the world has literally turned in the last couple of years. And there is a spirit of fear that is pervading the whole world. It's like a mist that's just come in. And the devil, of course, is right involved in that. But the Lord Jesus says in 2 Timothy 1.7, I have not given you a spirit of fear but of power, of love, and of a sound mind. Now, early this morning, when I was having my quiet time, I've got a book, a devotional that I read, written by a very good friend of mine, Ron Wesson, who's also an evangelist. And he tells the story of the time that he went to Edinburgh in Scotland. And I think it's so, so appropriate for the times in which we are living. But I want to share with you, first of all, a scripture. And it comes from the book of Isaiah, chapter 26. And I'm reading from verse 3. The Lord says, You will keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed focused, stayed upon you, because he trusts in you. Verse 4, Trust in the Lord forever. For in Yahweh the Lord is everlasting strength. Our trust is not in anything else. It's in the Lord Jesus Christ. You can't trust anyone. In fact, sir, I want to say to you, it's not fair to put your trust in your wife or you, madam, to put your trust in your husband because it's too much of a load to carry, okay? Because we are just human. We need to put our trust in the Lord. Now listen to this beautiful little story. He says he went to Edinburgh in Scotland. It was a busy day. The traffic was hectic. He stood on an intersection and he was trying to cross over the road. But there were cars and buses and trucks going up and down the road. And as he stood there with his hands down, he felt someone take a hold of his hand. And he looked down and there, there was a little girl. I don't know how old she was. Maybe she was 10 years old. I don't know. And she took a hold of his hand, a stranger. And he looked down and he saw this little girl obviously wanting to cross the road. But she was afraid of the traffic. She never spoke to him, just took a hold of his hand. And they crossed over together. And as he got to the other side, she slipped away into the crowd and he never saw her again. Simple faith. Simple trust. No words needed. No speaking. Just trusting. He said for himself, there was a glow of gratitude came over him. That that little girl <laughs> trusted a stranger, this man, to walk her across the street. And he finishes up his reading by saying how the heart of Jesus rejoices when you and I trust Him completely. I want to say to you today, put your hand in the hand of the man that created the universe. And what have you to fear? Do you think He will not take you across that street? Of course He will safely and he will take you home to heaven with him and so we need to today we need to put our trust in Jesus Christ just like that little girl put her hand in the hand of that evangelist and walked across the street with him and then disappeared into the crowd hold the hand of Jesus today and you will be safe in his presence God bless you and goodbye